originally y'all met online. Let's, let's on Tinder. It. On Tinder. Yeah. Okay. And he tried to hang out with me for like I don't know, like two weeks, and she just kept blowing me off, kept blowing me off. And then Dave made me promise him that I would go on one date to see if I liked Gabe. <laughs> so who was Dave? I said, he's nothing like anybody that you've ever been with. A really nice guy. And because of that, then she decided that she was going to meet up with him. And they met up in Walmart. Um, I was at Walmart with my friends and I had like, he was like, oh, let's hang out. And I'm like, okay, like I'm at Walmart and lab, like either you're going to be here or you're not. Like that's how I was looking at it for shopping and I like looked down at the basket to like put something up and I looked up and Gabe was like standing there and he was just like, hello. And I was like, oh. <laughs> I mean, that first day when we locked eyes was just fireworks. I like her personality. It's just awesome. She's got a great outlook on life. And that drew me even closer and just ever since that day we've building and building our love so much more every day and it's just awesome. Just every part of her brings every good part out in me. What is the one thing that maybe people don't already know that they should know every time they see the power couple Chelsea and Gabe hatch? She's my queen. He's my king. Chels, when I first saw you online, I knew you were going to be a cool person to know. What I didn't know was that I would find my best friend and future wife. I'm glad I wouldn't stop bugging you until we met in person. Thanks, Dave, for putting a good word in for me. You almost blew me off that day, but when we locked eyes in Walmart, fireworks exploded. That day was the start of our journey together. From that moment on, we haven't left each other's side. We have been through great loss and conquered it by punching waves that time in the ocean. We have seen so many beautiful places and made so many awesome memories on our adventures. Every memory we have made has been special, even when we went fishing and all you caught was your hand. We have built an incredible life in such a short amount of time. I can't thank you enough for being so sweet and loving to me and treating me like a king. Your smile is so warm and it makes me smile. I love when you, we are goofballs together and talk in accents and make fun of each other. I love road trips with you. Listening to our music and talking about our hopes and dreams is one of my favorite things to do with you. I can't wait to build our empire together. You are my queen, my soulmate, and my best friend. And I can't wait to spend the rest of my life with you. So, now, Gabe. Yes. It's your wedding day. It is. How you feeling? I'm very excited. Any last words before? That sounds bad. That's the wrong terminology, but... <laughs> Any last before words? Before you jump the broom, tie the knot, etc., cetera, etc.? Cetera? I'm just happy to spend the rest of my life with the person I'm supposed to be with forever. Beautiful. That's all I got. I know I'm going to cry. I'm so nervous. <laughs> 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 oh my god. <laughs> so pretty. <laughs> oh, you're so that pretty. Wasn't really you. <laughs> you look so good. I want to kiss you so bad. <laughs> I've dropped it. We can't kiss. We're not married yet. Gabe, from the first time our eyes met, I knew my life would change forever. From our first date at Chuck E. Cheese's to you buckling in the toilet paper to make me laugh, our journey has been so eventful. When you got on one knee at the Kane Brown concert as he sang our song in the background, I knew I would never say no. You have given me everything I have ever dreamed of simply by being you. From some of the best days in my life, we have been through tough loss. We cried together, prayed together, and took off to the ocean to get our minds off our loss 
We have two babies looking down on us on our wedding day and every day for the rest of our lives. You and I have a bond that will never be broken. Through this journey called life, I could not ask for a better partner, lover, and best friend. Every day we grow together, we learn together, and we take on this world together. You are my soulmate. You have my entire body and soul for the rest of my life. You help me mentally, spiritually, and guide me when I am lost. I am so lucky to be marrying you, Gabriel. I cannot wait to steal your last name. Wonder if Jack and I had ever made it After the drums and the guitars all faded Was the best they could do good enough Or did the heartland just swallow them up How did my mom and my dad ever do it If there were struggles and we never knew it I guess they had each other And that was enough You know you can't keep the ground There's no such thing as a broken heart You gotta love Like there's no such thing as a broken heart What am I gonna tell my kids when they see All of this bullshit that goes down on TV When the whole world is down on its luck I gotta make sure they keep their chin up Cry when it hurts Laugh when it's funny Chase after the dream Don't chase after the money And no, we got each other that's what's up Cause you can't keep the ground from shaking No matter how hard you try You can't keep the sunsets from fading You gotta treat your life like you're jumping off a road swing Baby, cause the whole thing's really just a shot in the dark You gotta love like there's no such thing as a broken heart You gotta love like there's no such thing as a broken heart Who gives this woman to be wed to this man? I do. Princess, not a woman. <laughs> <laughs> okay, just a minute. We're just gonna say a prayer. Heavenly Father, we thank you and praise you for this day. We thank you for the sunshine above our heads. We thank you for the ground beneath our feet. Lord, we ask that you bless Gabe and Chelsea this day as they unite as one in your flesh, Lord. Lord, we just praise you and we thank you for everyone that is gathered here today as they give witness to Gabe and Chelsea 
and their marriage and that they, Lord, will hold them up with strength and bind them together, Lord. We just praise you for this day. We praise you for Gabe and Chelsea. We give you honor and glory in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. There's a bee that likes us. <laughs> like everybody else. You can sit. Throughout time, countless millions of people from many cultures, religions, and societies have gathered among friends and families to celebrate their love for one another and their commitment to each other. Each has symbols and rituals to celebrate the marriage, from the Chinese tea ceremony to, to the Jewish traditional glass breaking. A rich tapestry of traditions from around the world combine to symbolize meaning of marriage. Today, we should try to remember that a wedding is a symbol. A heartfelt and meaningful symbol, but a symbol nonetheless. This ceremony is not magic. It will not create a relationship that doesn't already exist and has not already been celebrated in all the commitments Gabe and Chelsea have made to each other, both large and small, since that first day their eyes met at Walmart. <laughs> what we are celebrating today is not the beginning of a marriage, but a marriage already in progress. This ceremony is a symbol of how far they have come together and a symbol of the promise that they have, will continue to make to each other throughout their lives. The symbolic vows that you are about to make are a way of saying to one another, you know all the things that we promised and hoped and dreamed? Well, I meant it, every word. Look at one another and remember this moment in time. Before this moment, you have been many things to one another. Friend, lover, fiance, soulmate. But now you will say a few words that take you across the threshold of life. Things will never be quite the same. For after these vows, you will say to the world, this is my husband, this is my wife. Nothing is easier than standing here and saying these words, and nothing is more difficult than living them day to day. When you love someone, you don't love them all the time in exactly the same way. That's impossible. Yet that is what most of us expect. We forget the ebb and flow of life and love and of relationships. We insist on permanence, on duration, continuity. But in love, as in life, the only stability is in change, in growth, and in freedom. Therefore, what you promise today must be renewed and reaffirmed tomorrow and all the tomorrows to come. Having considered all these things, Gabe, do you promise to do your very best each day to create a loving, healthy, and happy marriage, even if she's, even if she's being the princess we all know she can be? I do. <laughs> Chelsea, do you promise to do... When Gabe is a princess? <laughs> well, I was going to say prince, but... <laughs> do you promise to do your very best each day to create a loving, healthy, and happy marriage? I do. Gabe and Chelsea have decided to do their vows together. Gabe will lead. <laughs> Please take hands. To reach out to someone and be acknowledged and loved is a human need. Taking the hand of, of one who loves you is a powerful symbol of that unspoken bond. Please take a good look at your partner's hands so you may see the gift that God has given to you. These are the hands of your best friend that are holding yours on your wedding day. These are the hands that will work alongside yours as together you build your hatch empire. <laughs> These are the hands that when wrinkled and aged 
will still be reaching for yours. This is the point in the ceremony when people usually talk about the wedding bands being a perfect circle, having no beginning, no end. But we all know that there is a beginning. Rock is dug up from the earth, metals are liquefied in a furnace at a thousand degrees. The hot metal is forged, cooled, and then painstakingly polished. Something beautiful is made from raw elements. Love is like that. It comes from humble beginnings made by imperfect beings. It is the process of making something beautiful where there was once nothing at all. Gabe, please place this ring on Chelsea's finger and repeat after me. I take you now and you. Sorry. <laughs> I take you now and for always. And for always. For always is always now. For always is always now. <laughs> is this the right one? Chelsea? I take you now and for always. I take you now and for always. For always. For always. Is always. Is always. Now. now. <laughs> and now it gives me great pleasure to introduce you to Miss and Mr. and Mrs. Gabriel Scotch. Scott. Scott Hatch. <laughs> Scotch. <laughs> Think what I'm thinking. <laughs> you may kiss <laughs> your bride. <laughs> Okay. I don't need it. Just a minute. Just another night, didn't say much. I was 
be scared for my life I didn't catch your number and didn't know your name Tried to move on, couldn't help to think of you Now I knew that you'd change everything What's mine is yours Every breath I take, every choice I make It might sound crazy, all my pain Washed away in the blink of an eye Yeah, you saved me You got all of me And I don't need it anymore Well, Mama told me when I was young Said sit beside me My only son And listen closely To what I say And if you do this It'll help you Some sunny day I yet we When a single mom goes out on a date with somebody new It always winds up feeling more like a job interview My mama used to wonder if she'd ever meet someone Who wouldn't find out about me and then turn around Man, I call my dad when I was five years old. He took my mom out to a movie, and for once I got to go. A few months later, I remember lying there in bed. I overheard him pop the question, and I prayed that she'd say yes. And then all of a sudden, oh, it seemed. So strange to me how we went from something's missing to family. Uh, congrats, Gabe and Chelsea. Um, you're beautiful. I love you. Love you. Thank you. 